students i am your komali ma'am in this session i am going to teach you an excellent and a typical question from ncert solid state chapter see this question if the radius of the octahedral void is r and the radius of the atoms in close packing is capital r derive the relation between small r and the capital r this is one of the hidden question in ncert exercise which makes the students to think how to do the derivation but in today's session your komali ma'am is going to tell you a super tip for you just to follow this video watch this video up to the end then you will explain your friends in your classroom this easy methodology let's begin the session octahedral void means how it will form let us see for example there are four spheres like this these four spheres are in one plane and one atom above the plane like this above this one atom from down there will be total six atoms between these six atoms there is a void here is a void can you see this void here this is a void so total four atoms in one plane one above the plane one below the plane between the six atoms there is a void here the that void is called as which void octahedral void so four atoms in the one plane and one above the plane one below the plane this atom which is above the plane it forms four phases and down atom four phases total eight phases that's why octahedra octa that name is given fine let us see how to derive this expression this is center of this octahedron this is center of the octahedron now this is the center of this sphere draw one line from here to here and one line from here to here one line from here to here so this center of the atom to this well outer shell is capital r listen carefully from this outer shell to the center atom is small r students and this is capital r this is small r see from center of this to what i told you this is a capital r right how to find this angle or how to substitute how to find the relation i am going to teach you now make one center here make one center here make one center already you made join these four centers you will get one square like this and in that square what is the angle in a square 90 degree perfect square right this is a square what will be the angle students tell me 90 then you are making exactly half of this then it will be 45 degree what is this this is 45 degree here what i want to tell you is my intention is cos cos theta is equal to adjacent by hypotenuse is the formula what is the formula cos theta is equal to adjacent by hypotenuse ma'am what is this cos theta what is this adjacent and what is this hypotenuse see this is the longest length is there na this one which i made you to draw this is called as an uh, hypotenuse so hypotenuse value is how much small r plus capital r because from center to the valence shell is capital r and that octahedral void this radius is small r and adjacent is capital r cos theta value how much 1 by root 2 cos 45 degree because here angle is 45 how i got 45 total square is 90 in that half we have made to find that radius then it will be cos 45 1 by root 2 then don't worry how to find this 1 by root 2 i am going to tell you just do the cross multiplication r plus capital r, capital r plus small r is equal to root 2 r so what is root 2 value students 1 sorry 1.414 r then small r is equal to 1.414 if this r comes this side then it will be 
plus r if it comes this side it will be minus r then the value is 0.414 r that's it means small r is the radius of uh, this octahedral void which is equal to 0.414 capital R. This is fine. But when I substituted cos theta value, I mean cos 45 degree, what came into your mind? Ma'am, how you substituted cos 45 1 by root 2 as a neat aspirant? For me, it is difficulty. It is difficult to find it and to substitute. So today, I am going to tell you one small tabular column which gives you clear clarity anywhere if you see cos value, sin value or tan value without any difficulty you will do that. Let me tell you that. First make one box like this students. One is for 0, one is for 30, one is for 45 degree, one is for 60 degree, one is for 90 degree. Is that clear? Now what you will do is write sin theta, sin here, here cos you write. Here tan you write. You may think ma'am why ma'am I am a uh, neat aspirant. Is it important for me to learn? But one time if you spend just two minutes to complete this table. Then from next time if any chapter chemical kinetics you do now or surface chemistry. Anywhere you see that angle you won't feel any discomfort easily you will do it. Let's begin. First uh, some steps I will tell you just follow it. Take 0, 1, 2, 3, 4. What I did? 0, 1, 2, 3, 4. Now, second step. Step number 2. Divide this one with 4. 1 by 4, 2 by 4, 3 by 4, 4 by 4. 0 by 4, 0 by anything is 0. 1 by 4, 1 by 4. 2 by 4 means how much? 2 ones are, 2 twos are. 1 by 2 you get. 3 by 4 as it is. 4 by 4 is 1. Now, in this is step number 3, 3 steps total. First step is 0, 1, 2, 3, 4. Second step is divide with 4. And the next step is keep root. That's it over. What you have to do students? You should keep root, root, square root. Square root of 0 is 0. Square root of 1 by 4 is how much? 1 by 2. Because you are keeping square to that. Now, square root of 1 by 2, 1 by root 2. Square root of root 3 by root 4 is 2 square root of root 1 square root of 1 is 1 that's it your sign value is over first 0 1 2 3 4 then you divide with a 4 then keep root three steps keep in your mind cos is very easy just write sign values in reverse this one you keep here next root 3 by 2 you keep next 1 by root 2 next 1 by 2 0 over. Ma'am, how to find tan value? Tan theta is also very easy. Tan theta is equal to cos theta. Sin theta by cos theta. That's it. 0 by 1. 0. 1 by 2. Here I'll write. 1 by 2 divided by root 3 by 2 means 2 is denominator as denominator so it comes up root 2 root 2 will be cancelled 1 by root 3 and 1 by root 2 1 by root 2 root 2 root 2 will be cancelled 1 root 3 by 2 1 by 2 root 3 by 2 1 this 2 is denominator as denominator when you are dividing it comes to numerator so root 3 1 by 0 1 by 0 is infinity that's it Keep this box with you, even you are a neat aspirant. Then when anywhere if you see also, you don't feel any discomfort. Is it clear? Now see the previous one. Octahedral void, what is the relation? Small r is equal to 0 0.414 to uh, 414 capital R. Like this, so many videos are there. So many tricks are there in Komali Ma'am channel. Once go through all the videos, whenever you get the time, every day one video or two video or the topic wise, you see it. 
definitely you will improve so much still if you want to learn from me the complete syllabus from basics to the depth then if you want to enroll into the batches which are going on you can uh, whatsapp your details to my whatsapp number 9110662880 i'll give in the description you know for free classes you can go through my channel so much free content i uploaded thank you so much for watching this video see you in another video with awesome concept excellent tricks bye students take care komali ma'am 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 komali ma'am